welcome to today's video where we'll be comparing three powerful language models ChatGPT, Bard and Bing. Each one of these models serve unique purposes and we'll be exploring their strengths and weaknesses to determine which one is best suited for a specific task. To keep the comparison unbiased, we'll be giving the same task to each model. Let's begin by looking into each model individually, examining their respective strengths and weaknesses. First up is ChatGPT. While it offers a more isolated experience, it is exceptional as it can be accessed via any browser. It excels as a personal assistant, providing powerful integrations and plugins. However, when it comes to research assistance, its accuracy may sometimes fall short compared to search engines like Bing. ChatGPT relies on pre-existing data prior to 2021 rather than real-time search results, which can limit its effectiveness in handling complex or technical queries. Moving on to Microsoft Bing AI. Bing's AI can be easily accessed through a browser or mobile app, making it user-friendly even for those unfamiliar with AI technology. Bing Chat Integrated into Microsoft Edge, it offers a tailored and seamless way to search for answers, making it an excellent research assistant. One notable advantage of Bing is its integration with other Microsoft products such as Office and Windows, enabling effortless access and sharing search results across multiple platforms. Now let's shift our focus to Google's Bard. Powered by Google's Pathways language model, Palm 2, Bard shines as a research tool providing responses based on real-time and current event source from Google search. Notably, BARD allows users to edit their questions after they are asked and presents multiple prepared responses. Each response includes a CTA that suggests Googling for further confirmation of its sources. BARD's integration with Google Workspace streamlines the process of uploading BARD's response to Gmail or Google Docs. However, it's important to note that BARD lacks the ability to store or track previous conversations, which may hinder its usability for some users. Now let's put these models to test by subjecting them to same set of queries across different topics. We'll start by asking them about the weather in New Delhi for the next 7 days. As you can see, BARD response might come across as dry and less engaging compared to Bing's AI response. Next, we'll request each model to provide a visual output by asking for a picture of a neoclassicism. Here Google's BARD emerges as clear winner, capable of generating visual outputs, while ChatGPT and Bing fall short of this expect. Lastly, we'll test their creative abilities by asking them to write a poem for a 85-year-old father who loves playing football in the spring season and farming and scouts for his children during the winter. As you can see, ChatGPT claims a top spot in this category, presenting a well-structured and beautifully written poem that rhymes and flows remarkably well. Now let me conclude the video for you and tell which one you should use according to your needs. See, if you are looking for a creatively visual output, you should go for BART. And if you are looking to research in general, which involves real-time data in general, then you should go for Bing AI. And if you are looking to generate some textual or creative content, then simply go with ChatGPT. Share your thoughts and experiences with these AI models in the comment section below. If you found this video informative and enjoyable, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more exciting content like this.